Hi, I'm Judy Vetter. I'm Tom Sale. Welcome to the Tom and Judy Show. This is my new studio and then one day a week Tom comes in and we conjure wild and crazy things together. At first I've gone from 220 square feet to a thousand square feet so mostly a lot of it when Tom started working with me, all of a sudden we ran out of room and so we moved here. Most of the work we're doing right now is upstairs because uh, that's where the table is and the sewing machine and, and this is where we work. The light's great because of the windows and uh, this is the mess. Well, here is what Judy did before I came along, <laughs> and this is what we do now. <laughs> Things go from being cute to being cute with a twist, creepy twist to them. <laughs> you know, I've been sewing all my life, and a couple of years ago, I was going to quit. <laughs> I was kind of like, I can't do this anymore, and then a mutual friend of ours suggested that Tom and I work together, and Tom... And I started being studio acquaintances and it's been revitalizing for me personally. So that thus some of the silly stuff you see around. I still keep trying to do my normal crafting, but Tom is a good in, good bad influence. Well and Judy's a good bad influence. <laughs> Do you know where we cemented the partnership was two years ago or three? Three years ago. At, at an art conspiracy party. Yes. That's where we decided that this would be a fun thing to do. Yeah. So we can blame the art conspiracy. <laughs> well, that's the big advantage of this space is that, that we can, that I can work here, Tom can come and work, and we have tons of display space and do shows and um, it's, there's a great courtyard, it's a really wonderful building, and plus we're across from the State Fair of Texas. What could be better? This is real scientific. <laughs> I don't know if we want our method on camera, Tom. Voila, faux embroidery. <laughs> well, we're calling them the ghosts of Gianni Versace, the ghost of Yves Saint Laurent, the ghost of Coco Chanel, all the deceased designers. These are their uh, skulls come back to life. It's a big quilt here. Uh, we probably fought more than we <laughs> ever have on this piece uh, over what should go what should go on there, and that's you know it's half stuff I found on the street that Judy said I'm not letting that dirty piece of <laughs> trash in my studio, and half of it was stuff she had of sewing materials and buttons and notions and things, and it just kind of turned into it kind of grew a life of its own. 